Hey, what's up guys? Today we're unboxing these Ducky Frozen Llama keycaps. These were sent to me from a client for their build that's coming up soon. Uh, she had to purchase them on eBay, but they were originally available on mechanicalkeyboards.com. So let's take a look here at the product page. While we're looking at this product page, be sure to go ahead and hit that like and subscribe so you don't miss any future content. These keycaps were available for $49 with free shipping, which is always a nice perk. They were designed in collaboration with Ducky by mechanicalkeyboards.com. There's 108 double shot teal, alpha, and blue modifiers, as well as 11 PBT double shot purple keycaps. They're Cherry MX compatible keycaps, and they are in OEM profile. So now that you know about those, let's pop in here and take a look at them. Let's get some opinions. Hopefully, she will be pleased with these on her build. I'm interested in seeing them because I have not personally purchased any keycaps from Ducky before. All right, um, I don't know what's going on with this plastic wrap. It's kind of like re-wrapped here, hopefully. They're still in good shape inside. Looks like they were re-wrapped and kind of shrink-wrapped, melted a little bit there. Let's see what these guys look like. We can get this plastic wrap off. There we go. Okay, so it looks like the keycaps have definitely shifted around in the box, so hopefully we don't open up to a huge mess here. And we are. Okay. Um, so, as far as I can tell, the keycaps so far look pretty good. Um, they are OEM profile. So, they seem to be just standard uh, no alphas on the modifiers, no wording. They're just text modifiers. Um, the colors are really nice. The legends appear to be crisp. Let me get that to focus there. Um, usually on like ear shifts and stuff is where you're gonna see any blur so let's take a look here at the control and the enter as you can see those legends are crisp i do notice there's a little bit of like plastic here on the edges but that's not going to be noticeable once you put it together little mold marks um i say these were double shot i guess they're double shot but they're not they're not like gmk double shot where it's got a bunch of uh cross hatching in there so let's take a little further look here and see hopefully we don't have a huge mess inside oh not too bad they did include a ducky matching keycap puller it's kind of cool so if you want a matching keycap puller with your sets apparently ducky includes those i don't know if that's in all sets um so we've got two trays here it's like you've got everything you'll need for a full keycap set um, there's a couple sort of novelty keys. There's one here with a ducky logo, one that I don't know what that is supposed to be. And then you've got the mechanicalkeyboards.com logo. Um, all in all, they appear to be good keycaps. Oh, you've got a little llama here that's shine through apparently, which for the build we're doing, shine through is not going to do much because these are going on a board with underglow. But um, yeah, so... All in all, I would say not a bad keycap set. This is the first Ducky keycap set I've looked at, so I can't say if this is their normal quality or if this is below or above their normal quality, but as far as I can tell, it seems to be a decent keycap set, so I will not uh, rule out purchasing Ducky keycaps in the future, that's for sure. But um, yeah, all in all, I think it's a nice looking keycap set, and I think the client will be quite pleased with it. Let me zoom in a little bit here, get you one last look at these before we end. Thanks for hanging out, guys. I appreciate you being here. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope to see you in another video. And most of all, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your week. See you later.